What are the prospects? I mean, you're looking at uh, 19 states. Is it possible that we're going to be surprised and maybe see a majority of states be able to come up with the money? I, I would expect that, you know, mo- most of the states qualify and they can use their their hundred dollars they're paying for uh, unemployment insurance to qualify to get at least another three hundred dollars from the federal government so I, I hope we see the majority of the states and hopefully since speaker pelosi is coming back to, to look at postal hopefully she'll be more interested in sitting down and, and let me just say as part of postal i think you know i chaired a task force for the president on the post office i also chaired the federal financing bank we're the largest creditor to the post office. So I've spent a lot of time studying this over the last two years. And the, the post office has plenty of cash on hand. They have about $15 billion cash on hand. We've signed a term sheet, which is part of the CARES Act, to give another $10 billion if they need it. And Speaker Pelosi and Schumer and Meadows and I uh, agreed on another $10 billion to the post office, which we didn't think was completely necessary, but we agreed to as part of an overall deal to make sure they have money. And, uh, you know, unfortunately, we can't we can't go through with that. But we were going to attach that to PPP and direct payments and money for schools and hospitals and vaccine and lots of other important things.